Hello, fellow crafters. I am back again with another tutorial for you. This time showing how you can use PicSVG.com to take a picture or a photograph that you have and convert it into an SVG that you can then upload into Cricut Design Space. So the first thing you do is go to the website, PicSVG.com. There's no www in front of it. Uh, then we're going to go to upload a picture. And I'm just going to pick a picture of my hubby and me that I can show you. There are seven different filters that you can click through. So I always start with number one. And then it gives you a little preview of it. And while well, this might work, you know, it doesn't have a whole lot of detail. So I'm going to click on option number two. And on this one, there's a lot of little pieces here that, you know, might kill me when I'm trying to weed it or something. So I'm going to check what my other options are. So I'll click on three. And on this one, it has some better definition and not as many of those little pieces. But I'm still going to keep checking. Number four. Number four gives me some thicker pieces for my machine to cut out, which would probably work a little bit better. Um, and there's less of the little tiny pieces to have to try to weed. Then you can go into these ready options, ready number one. And you can see there's a lot of, of dark um, pieces there, and you can't really get a good picture of what that is. Ready number two, same thing, it's just a little bit more um, I don't know the word, smoothed out or not, not as detailed. And then number three, actually, you know, it might not be too bad if my face weren't half blocked out. So on this one, I would probably go with invert number four, where I get a nice outline, but not too much detail. And then you just click on download SVG. And it downloads it for you right here. Um, and then you're ready to just take that file and upload it into Cricut Design Space. I will tell you that when you go to upload this, all these pieces that are separated, and like, like this little piece right here that I'm pointing at, it's going to be its own piece. So it's not going to give this to you as one solid uh, piece for you to cut. So when you go into Cricut Design Space and you upload this, go ahead and while everything is selected, ungroup. Select everything and weld it or attach it um, so that way it cuts as one single cut and you don't have all those little pieces. Uh, something else you can do if you don't want some of these details like up here in the windshield or in the background, since each one is separate, you can just click and delete, click and delete, and you can delete a lot of that extra um, and just leave yourself with the pieces that you want. So anyway, I hope that you found this tutorial helpful. Again, using PIC SVG to take a photograph uh, and make it into a cuttable image that you can use in Cricut Design Space. If you found this helpful, I would really appreciate a thumbs up. Uh, no, nobody else is, is asking me to make these videos. I'm making them just for you, uh, but I do want to make sure that I am making videos that you find helpful. So I hope that you have a great day and uh, go on craft some more. Thank you.